What's up beautiful people? This is Khuram from My Guess Well and hope you all are having an amazing day. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about the extension cable for Tesla wall charger. And this is my Thor right here and it is plugged in to the charger that I have outside the house. We're gonna be talking about hypothetically, if you have the Tesla wall charger, the cable length is 24 feet. So if you need more than that, we have a solution that I'm going to talk about in this video. So I have the Tesla Model Y long range, which I park outside and you can see the situation where I have a Highlander, which is parked in the front. So I have the Model Y performance that my wife uses. So if she wants to get out, I have to make sure the way is clear for her to get out. That's why I have the Highlander park in the front. So let's say if I had only one charger and also I'm using only EV car. So I'm driving the one that is the black model Y long range and this Y performance. And I have a dedicated charger for both the cars. So this one right here, if situation is that I have only one charger, I can charge the car that is parked inside the garage, but I won't be able to charge the car which is outside because I have to make the way clear so that my wife can go in the morning and drop off the kids and I have to get out myself to work. So I have the Highlander, which is parked here. I kept the Highlander for the case, like, you know, when I'm going for a long ride with more people, so it can accommodate seven people. So now we have a solution from the Lectron and it is 48 amp, the maximum that you can get from the Tesla wall charger, it supports that. And we're gonna be testing that, also the build quality. And I compared this cable, extension cable, with the Tesla cable, and it was surprisingly amazing. I'll show you guys the comparison in the end of this video, but let's unbox this and you see inside there's a nice case. There is the connector that goes inside your Tesla. And the other side that we have, that is for connecting the Tesla wall charger cable with this extension right here. So we have one male and one female connector. So now I'm gonna be showing you how you connect that. This is how it is. It is pretty heavy and sturdy cable and it is 20 feet long. So you connect it with the Tesla wall charger cable and you will be getting total length of uh, 44 feet because Tesla wall charger is at 24 feet and this one is 20 feet. It has two 8 AWG, which is eight gauge copper conductors and also it has 10 gauge, so it is pretty thick when it comes to the extension cable. And we're gonna be connecting it to the Tesla wall charger original cable to provide that extended range for the cable so it can reach the maximum distance of 44 feet in total. As you can see now, this cable is connected to the wall charger that I have outside the house. And we're gonna be testing in the car when we plug it in, whether we get the full 48 amp charging or not. One thing that I want to mention here that the button on the extension from the Electron cable, it does not work. So you have to manually unlock the charging port and also you cannot take out the charging port because the button doesn't work. So you have to use the cell phone device or inside the car that you have to press the button to unlock the charging port in order to plug the charger in. It is not painful, but it's another step. Okay, inside the car now you saw the car is charging and you can see that it's charged at 84%. I usually charge this car at 90% maximum. And in the charging, I'm getting the maximum of the 48 amp current that is coming out of the Tesla wall charger using this extension. And you can see I have the 48 out of 48 amp total charging and it is charging pretty fast as it should be. I'm already reached the capacity where like it's gonna reach 90%, so it goes to slow charging, but the total ampere is 48. And this is the original Tesla versus the extension. You can see how thick the Electron extension cable is. So if you're worried about the extension cable not being good quality, I can assure that the Tesla wall charger cable is actually inferior in front of this Electron cable because the way the thickness is, it's way more thicker with the uh, two um, inside the conductors for the copper eight uh, gauge cables and also in support with the 10 gauge. And also we have this nice casing that you can take your extension anywhere you want to. 
So that's all I have from this video. I hope you liked this video. Um, if you did, make sure to subscribe the channel. I have the link in the description if you're interested in buying it. I'll see you guys in another video. Until then, peace out.